Hey guys, it's me, Conan, and today I'm in a weird mood. But I felt like vlogging. I don't, I'm gonna put this down somewhere. So basically, right now I am parked in a car in the middle of nowhere. I don't know where I am. I definitely am lost. I've just kind of been driving around my town for like an hour and a half because I felt like getting out of the house because I've just been sitting in my house working for like the past four days. So now I'm here. I'm having a good time. There's a really, really beautiful, gigantic house, like, on top of the hill over there. I'm, like, a really curious person, and I really like to just drive around and look at people's houses and wonder, like, what type of people are in there and, like, what they're doing and what they do as a job and what their families are like. That's, like, my way of de-stressing is just kind of driving around and, I don't know, thinking about things other than my job and stuff like that. It's really pretty here. I really like it. I kind of wish I I lived like right here. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do today. I'm a workaholic. I just want to work all the time. It's definitely problematic for me. It's not even that I work a lot. I just like really stress about work a lot. And it's bad, I really shouldn't. Every once in a while I get in these moods where I'm like, I've been working for so long. And so I kind of like force myself to go outside and like feel the wind in my hair and not stay in my dusty room all day. So that's what I'm gonna do today. Sometimes I forget that I live in Texas and like I actually live in Texas. People literally grow things here, like plants. You can't see anything, nothing for like, you, like the horizon is just moves, fields. I live in that, which is weird. I like it, it makes me feel small. Small, I'm a small bee. So I sing to her as I fall on Which way do I go? So I do this thing where I drive really far away and then I purposefully get lost and don't use directions and just try to find my way back. And normally I can find my way back, like I'm pretty good at it, but I don't think I can do it this time. So I think I'll just use my phone. Right now I am sitting on some railroad tracks. <laughs> I really got myself lost this time, but um, that was kind of my goal, so check, achieved. <laughs> I am back at home now. I had a very interesting adventure. I was definitely lost, like there's no doubt about that. Found my way back home, and I've been home for like 30 minutes now, and I think that my friend Matoki is about to pick me up, because he's in town for the holidays, which is fun, because I don't get to see him very often. He's like, what is there to do in your town? And I was like, Nothing. So we'll see what we'll end up doing. I had a very good date with myself. I drove around for like three hours, but it was good. It was good. It was a good time. Good memories. I'm just now noticing like right before I literally move in like a few months, how much of my town that I like don't even know about yet and like how many neighborhoods and how many roads and how many like random buildings that I just have never seen even though I've lived in this town for like almost seven years now, which is the longest I've ever lived in a city before. When I was younger, I'd always just move after like a year. So this is is definitely like where I would call like home like my hometown but there's just so much I don't know about it and I'm leaving in like a few months part of me just wants to like absorb as much of it as I can while I'm still here oh wait squirrel oh my god zoom faster look at him there it is squirrel who are you where is she going ah and now I guess I'll show Matoki whatever part of my town that is worth seeing <laughs> So I'm here with Matoki. Hey, what's good? It's your boy. <laughs> He's been my um, basically big brother since I was like five years old. So it's good. Yeah, it's been good to, you know, <laughs> raise you. I, yeah. I'm also his father. Yeah, it's kind of weird how that worked out genetically, but. Know. Yeah, you came from my balls, but at the same time, like, you're my brother, you know what I mean? But it's whatever. I try not to think about yeah, it too. Yeah, like, ball brothers, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> 
how, how PG is your audience? No, they're, they're okay. <laughs> so it's casual. No, it's casual. You know, we're just here having yeah, a great time. He's here in my tiny town for the, what is it? The, the Christmas. The Christmas. How have you People been liking the, it so far? Um, you know, it's not that special, let's be real. But, but at the same time, <laughs> right. like, that's... That's life, you know? That's like how I am. Yeah. I'm not that special. Yeah. De you're definitely not special. That's we all know that. No. We don't have to lie. <laughs> if we're being honest here. If we're being honest, I wish I'd never met myself. Yeah. I think about that every day, actually. Like, whenever I'm, like, going to sleep or waking up, I'm like, wow, like, what's my purpose in life? Like, mm -hmm. who am I? Mm -hmm. And why? That's why are really we here? You probably need to. <laughs> I'm like really glad I'm talking about a lot of existential crisis things yeah. with you. Yeah. It's been good. Welcome uh, to this thank town. You. It's been it's been stellar. It's been stellar. <laughs> Should we eat anything else today? Yeah. Hold on one second. What do you want? Just tater tots. Wow. Good morning, guys. It's really chilly this morning. I had a really nice time with Matoki yesterday. He is just such a kind person and I'm so glad that his everything in his life is going so well right now. So, love you Matoki. Yep. I think that today I'll probably hang out with my friend Ellie. So happy I don't have to go to school. <laughs> it's pretty windy today so I'm wearing my beanie because it really keeps me warm and this mock neck that I really liked, I talked about in my favorites video. What'd you have to, Rocky? Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Then I'm wearing this blue warm coat thing that's soft here, which is nice. And jeans. Let's go pick a belly. Me and Elle just watched Jackie. What did you think? It was so good, so It was beautiful. really pretty, like mm -hmm. every single shot was so pretty and Natalie Portman's amazing. It was really good. Would recommend. Mm -hmm. We were gonna watch another, but now we're gonna go to the domain instead because we feel like eating and looking at things that we can't afford. Yes. <laughs> Ellie's carrying a big bowl of soup. <laughs> I have sushi, gluten-free cookie, some peach tea. Wow. We good. These aren't ripe yet. These roses aren't ripe. <laughs>
had a really nice day with Ellie. I love her so much and I'm just so glad that I have a friend like her. I had a really good time. Just kind of like did whatever we wanted. We always have the weirdest amount of fun walking around stores. So I love spending days with her. I just got my new journal, which is a lectern instead of a moleskin. And it's all white pages like this. It's not lined, so it's more like a sketchbook. So it'll be easier for me to like draw inside this one instead of writing in it. So I'll be able to write and draw in it, which is gonna be really nice. So I think I'll just end this day with some journaling, talking about my day. My face is really red because I washed it, but wow, very interesting. Good night. Well, I look crazy. But good morning. I just started off my day with um, planning out like this weekend or the rest of this week and all of next week. So that's like all my videos. Down here I write like the two videos that are going up this week because I upload twice a week. And so you can see that and like there was all the editing for that. So this was already done. Um, and so today I have to film 18 lessons that I learned by the age of 18 and I'm gonna start editing it and I need to make sure to remember to vlog. Editing, upload, and then edit vlog. Yeah, so I just like plan everything out. When I know I'm gonna have a particularly stressful day, I like to start off the day with planning so that I don't have all my thoughts jumbled up in my head and then I like can't do anything. Cause if you're anything like me, when I have a lot of things to do, my brain like can't pull out like what's important to do and the things that aren't important to do. Yeah, and today's gonna be a productive day hopefully. I just finished filming my 18 lessons that I learned the hard way by the age of 18. Aftermath, I mean, I've cleaned up a lot of it already. Now I'm gonna get some real clothes on because all I'm wearing is this without a shirt under it and um, pajamas. So real clothes on and then I'll probably head to Starbucks to edit because boy has work to do. Good night. What you doing, Rocky? Wow. Good morning. It is New Year's Eve. I love New Year's because it's kind of like a good time that I don't know, separate things that happened that year into the next year because we all know that the things that happened in 2016 this is really pushed out really far away. I'm currently just finishing up a video. Hanging out with Rake. He's so cute. I will catch him later. I'm on my way to my friend's house and I checked the mail and I got my new chapstick, which like sounds like a very weird thing to be excited about, but my lips, they're crackly guys. And I need chapstick all the time. Here's a little packet. It's from this company named Hurrah. And you guys have actually asked me about this before. This isn't sponsored by the way. You guys have asked me what chapstick I use because you'll see like sometimes in my vlogs I have like super shiny lips. It's this. <laughs> and so I bought some for me and my sister. Oh. They gave us something for free. That's sweet. Plus something fun on us. That's really sweet. This is the one that I always get. It is incredible. And then I wanted to try this one, which is, has like sunblock in it. And they gave me this one for free. That's so nice. Thank you, hurrah. The light that flickers will blow with a sigh. And all that will away and Good morning. It is January 1st, 2017, and things are the same. But <laughs> I try not to like amp up the new year too much because I don't know, throughout the course of my life, I've always just kind of been like, if there's something I want to change about my life, then like just change it, like go change it. Like you don't need a holiday to tell you to change your life. But I, you know, I like the new year because for a lot of people, it marks a time of change and if a holiday is what it's going to take for people to be nicer or better to themselves, then I'm all about it. Um, I think that with change, you kind of have to not have that many rules. Like, 
if you fail one time, you can just keep trying and keep going towards what your goal is. I hope that you guys all had an incredible New Year's with people you loved and um, um, a lot has changed on my YouTube channel s since like the past week. I went from like 107,000 subscribers to 140,000 subscribers. But um, every new person here, I just wanted to take a second to say hello and welcome to my channel. I really love having you here. Can't wait to spend the next year with all of you guys, all 140,000 of you guys. I am so grateful for you guys. I tell you in every video. In the comments below, I'd love to hear what kind of things you guys are hoping for in the new year and what kind of things you think will happen. Um, I'd love to hear about like any things you're looking forward to in the new year. Um, I think we could all use for a nice little positive uplift with this new year. I'll see you guys in a few days with a brand new video. God bless and goodbye.